Yeah. Let's just let's just talk about funny videos. <laughs> no, I know a bunch of funny videos. I just seen a Hasbulla pull a knife on a dog. I guess it was hilarious. A what? Hasbulla pulled a knife on a dog. Oh. It's like some guy walking his dog, but Hasbulla like pulled a knife out. <laughs> he wants to pet your dog. You can bring him here. Kids a menace. <laughs> he gets away with a lot. It's funny as hell, man. Like, he was like, I mean, he was like, <gasps> his cat. And they're like, no, no, no. I was uh, teaching it a lesson. Who's he related to again? Why? Why is he so involved in UFC? Nah, I think he's just like a. Just like a big um, influencer, like a like a viral he's just, moment. For he, he's just a viral viral star online, and he, like he just you know gets the numbers and people. He talks about things that he likes, and it becomes more popular. You know. Yeah, but like he moves around with these guys, like the UFC <laughs> fighter, isn't he's he? He's a he's just like an ambassador, you know, like a marketing. Just makes more money for the UFC to, you know, know. let let him like um, show off their their stuff. I mean, how and can he you gets not? more money. It's, it's Hasbulla. It's funny, man. That kid. You no, know, he's on the UFC game too, so it's it's like he's quite known in the the UFC world. They put him in the game. What did yeah. they do? Like a Halloween kind of costume kind of thing, where you can like dress like have a like his like his mask. A face mask. Yeah, his right? face mask of okay. him. So it's kind of funny, you know. It's kind of <laughs> like, they're kind of making fun of him. He's like a Halloween prop now. Nah, I mean. He's not a mascot, it's Hasbulla, you know? He is a mascot. Like, what, what? Yeah, he's a mascot. And you seen that shit when he's like, uh... Like, when he was like with Mike Tyson? Oh, he carried him like a baby? And kissed him and shit? <laughs> oh, yeah, he was like, no, he was like hitting that fool. He was hitting him in the face, right? Yeah. He was hitting Mike in the face. He was like, all right, chill, chill, chill. You know I could crush you to death, all right, you know? Yeah. That kind of thing. That's so bad. And Mike Tyson would say something like that. Remember that thing that he did on the plane? The dude just like kept aggravating him. Oh, he just like beat the. F him. Oh my. <laughs> this is George talking to Mike Tyson, bro. This shit crazy, bro. Mike Tyson. God, but he was like, man. I loved it. I like Lil Dream of getting beat up by Mike Tyson. He probably likes to be like stepped on with like high heels or something. Oh, I mean, he picked a fight That's against like weird. a f lion, basically. You know. <laughs> that blue map flight. My boy just got beat up by Mike Tyson. Turn that way. You saw mm -hmm. Hasbulla when when he got caught like um, doing like uh, he was like speeding and doing like reckless driving with his homies, and then they all get arrested. He drives. Yeah, he drives. They they can drive. They get the they get the like the leg extenders, you know, for the the the, the gas pedal. Oh my God! I saw I that little people can drive, man. You didn't no, know no, that. no, yeah, I know that, but I just I didn't know he drives. I didn't know. It'll be did. like people are sus suspicious of him, but now I guess like he's gotten so popular. They're like, oh, that's just Hasbulla. It's not a child. <gasps> yeah, yeah, like they they kind of know of him. Like they know what he's about. Like you know, just. Uh, I mean, he's not. He just likes to mess around. And I, I I think it's hilarious. I like those little videos when he whistles into like the the, uh, the microphone he's guy. Got a, he's got a good whistle. <laughs> <laughs> little troll, man. Yeah, like somebody has a taste for it, you know. Somebody's yeah, gotta like I it, mean, it's know? Mexican food, so like sometimes you know, even I'm not a big fan of certain plates. Like I'm not a big fan of menudo. You know, I love I, don't like I love that. pozole. I feel, I feel like menudo. it's slimy. It's very slimy. It's very you know? greasy. Very uh. Yeah, I don't like the. I don't like the. Um, Pozole, though, on the other hand. Pozole, I mean, it's stew, dude. Oh, my God, man. Pork stew. Yeah. All the veggies chopped up in there, you know. It's they, they, like some, like some, uh, some, some cold, like, you know, winter time, like, it's, it's about to come up time, kind of time, you know, like. That, that, that time. That warm That caldito. time kind of time when that time comes <laughs> up, you, you're going to get that pozole. <laughs> yeah, and then it's cold out there, and it's about that time, like that time oh my it's that, god it's a uh, it's the summer your mom's making pozole oh You're no like... <laughs> no that's, that's the worst man i think it's like very uh how do you say very uh how do you say canon event in, in, in a, a canon in a, yeah in a mexican canon? slash hispanic person's life like you know it's, it, you're gonna uh, experience a day a, where it's not a dream it's it's real life yeah it's gonna happen to it's gonna happen to everybody at least mm -hmm. once so you walk into the house and like 
it's it's hot as hell like why is it so damn hot but it smells like good food but it's hot as hell in there and like why because your mom just cooked a whole stew for some reason and like, <laughs> it's like it's, a nine, sauna. it's, it's, it's like a sauna. Not, it's like nine, it's 90 degrees outside i was just like ma you like you 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 know you know it's hot outside right like ma it's 95 degrees i'm not gonna eat no caldo entonces no tragues estás sudando but you know you can't tell like for mexican mom mexican moms you can't tell them shit that like, you know just just save it you know just take what you get like because they're gonna beat you Ooh, man i'm gonna be, gonna, that, that, that caldo's gonna be left over for days until you finish it. yeah it's gonna sit there you know, you know that shit, yeah, that shit congeals up we're like no like, Ew, it looks gross we're like no just warm it up it's gonna huh, warm it like, up warm new. it up you know, give it a little mixer you know yeah, yeah, yeah. Una latida, you know just like ah oh, no nah but we don't die from that so i assume that it was never going I mean, bad it's, you know? it's healthy for you but like goddamn like i mean like you know it's... Eat soup in the hot weather man like shit can i have a egg salad sandwich or some shit like something that, cold man? yeah something cold can i get know? cereal can you just make me a bowl of cereal please huh hey, put the milk in the ice i just got up on two percent milk a couple no years no no ago. no no get the almond milk now y'all trying to Conspiracy. No, 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 no. The, the, and it's the question. Is it from the almond of the walnut? Is they squeezing it out of the peanut? I don't have that answer. And I usually have every answer. Are you still into milk? Like animal milk? Because I, I just, I've, I've always... Uh, Wait, switched up to almond milk. Whatever other kind of milk. Really? Yeah. That's what you're doing now? I don't, I don't, I never liked like cow milk. Like, I think I grew out of it when I was like three years old or, you know, like at that time, you know, my mom used to tell me like, oh, you used to drink like the, uh, the cow milk right out of the cow, you know, a farm boy and all that. But the only way of me having milk is just with cereal. I feel like that might be one of the only times that a young person or at least a person from this generation or like in this case is a bunch of other younger generations, but like. I feel like we don't consume cow milk yeah, as but much it's, as we it's not. It's, I think it's not even that good for you either. I mean, not a lot of people are into it. There's people that are obviously lactose intolerant, you know? So, like, oh, shit, I mean, that was yeah. hard to say. That's um, why you're not supposed to have it. Yeah. But I don't see anything wrong with it. I mean, doesn't it, like, you like, you improve, like, drinking, like, bone you like density? You like cow milk. No, it doesn't. Uh, when you're a lot older, you don't, you don't. Um, well, not as much as it used to, you don't right? Get, I mean, from what I heard, it's like, with the pasteurization, they kind of remove, like, most of the... Like the those benefits, real nutrients. The, yeah, the benefits of having uh, milk work for you, and, it, and it's also like a cow milk product. Like uh, it works better if it's like a human, like coming from a human. Damn. And it's also more nutritious. You heard that people like try it, and then it like the like female like breast milk tastes like sweet. What the hell? Shit. So, so what do you think of the idea of like a breast milk latte? I think it's fabulous. Yeah, I mean, I I'm not gonna lie. I taste a little bit of my bre breast milk. is very sweet. Yeah, good, you know, I think yeah. it's good. It's like a uh, like Homelander. <laughs> <laughs> that TV show's wild, man. I can't believe. Really... I would have never watched it if it wasn't for you, honestly. Yeah, like, I, I that's, just, that's just good, man. <laughs> <laughs> 